Good morning. It is the last Thursday of 2018. And I don't know about you, but this year has been a huge roller coaster. If you recall where I started with a comminuted fracture of my right arm, having to edit with my, learn to edit with my left hand to where we've come all year and all of the wonderful Thursday work days that you've enjoyed. This is it for 2018. And today the focus is circling the wagons, pulling things in, and much like other gardeners around the country, I am not making a big winter push. I am trying to clean up and organize so that I can start 2019 and develop a great plan for next year. Now we're harvesting sweet potatoes today and we're gonna clean up all this uh, driveway container garden. And also I have special guest, Patty, coming from Las Vegas. I'm picking her up at the airport about 1.40 and we're gonna have a lot of fun the next few days and shoot some videos. So stay with me. Ginger is a tropical plant and it really likes a lot of moisture and heat, which we don't have right now. So we're gonna pull up this ginger and see what we've got and I can always replant some ginger and put it in a pot in my little greenhouse for the winter. I'm also going to have Eric dig up some of these comfrey roots to send to Gina in Mission Viejo who made a donation to my channel. Thanks, Gina. Maybe it's deeper. Is yep. it deeper? Yeah. Don't want. See? Oh, it's pretty small. We can leave it. See? Oh, yeah. It's but it's not, not gonna, ready. it's not gonna do anything in this cold weather. Oh, it smell good? Man, good. E, do mm. e. <laughs> I got dirt do on my e. nose. <laughs> <laughs> oh yes, that smells wonderful. I think I'm going to pot these so that they can keep growing. Just an update on the daikon radish. These are moving along and I need to mound them up. The leeks have really not done anything. This spot is where I had my goji berries, my prized goji berries that got absolutely covered in mildew and I just couldn't take it and I pulled them out. He just popped this ginger in here which is eliminates one pot sitting on the driveway. It's one plant. Oh, the whole thing? The whole thing. Mm -hmm. Wow, okay. That's beautiful. I can, I can cut, I split it outside. Okay. See, it's beautiful. Wow, okay. Oh, this. Is yeah, I want, I want half of that to go back in. <laughs> yeah. You can leave We can leave it a small one. Yeah. Okay? Yeah, leave the small That's one. It. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Let's see if you can kind of separate that somehow. Oh, you can move. See? Yeah. It's all together. <laughs> yeah. This is beautiful. Yeah, yeah. I think we can separate these. No, no, yeah. no breaking. It's okay. See? No, because it's one piece, see? See? Oh, this, see? No, let me see. I learned my lesson about planting those warm season crops late in the season, thinking that they might produce, and nothing did. So, not the okra, not the cow peas, none of that. So Eric is over there cleaning out the back 40 raised bed. You can see these sticky traps really do their job. These are covered. They cut down on numbers, they don't eliminate the problem.
this is the finished project. <laughs> it was all sticks in there and I decided to really cut it back. Hopefully it will fill in and look beautiful in about two weeks. Meanwhile, some of these bamboo pieces that were holding back wood chips around our water, our street water meter, rotted and fell over. And Eric is replacing those pieces with more of the bamboo that we've saved. Great. I'm solarizing my eggshells and I'll grind those up and use those in my planting mixture. Someone wrote and told me that this is not an artichoke. It's a relative called a cardoon and you eat the stalks and not the flower buds. I'm just gonna let it grow and see what happens. Okay, it's all done. All done. Finished for now. That looks great, oh, Eric. Thank oh you. No. I clean inside also. Inside. See the meter. See? Oh, clean. I see yeah. it now. Okay. Yes, Cover. thank you. Cover. Take it out. Can you hold it for me? Oh, yeah. Where you put this? The, the door. Just this the plant? Ah. This the potato? It's inside. I thought we would dump it down on the ground and then take the potatoes out. You want to just put no, it in here? Just okay. Very nice, eh? Oh, B. You. Wow. Is that everything? Yeah. Move it about. Here's this little piece, we can grow that back. Okay. Oh. Okay. Oh. Rather than get a, an enormous mound of potting soil, he's going to put them back in the pots and we'll figure out what to do with them later. Eric is going to continue to work on this project and I'm going to get ready to go to the airport and pick up Patty. This trellis is coming down and all of this is getting cleaned out. These border pieces that Renee found and brought to me, I'm actually not going to use. I've decided it would be too hard to try to make that look nice and it's got to be right out in front of my property. So he's going to cut this into pieces and we're going to recycle it and clean this all out and have a fresh start in 2019. These protocarpus trees above this fence drop this stuff and it's just a mess. When the sun shines on your vegetables, it is so pretty. Okay, so look who's here. It's Patty! Hi! <laughs> From Las Vegas! And she's gonna be staying with me for a few days and, and we're gonna hopefully it's gonna get warmer. It's freezing it's here. It's freezing! I think I'm back in Las Vegas. <laughs> this is as cold as it ever gets here. The hibiscus has two major stems at the bottom. We're gonna take off the one that kind of shoots out and cut it all the rest of it all back and see if it buds out, leaves out.
Eric and I want to thank you for watching all of our Thursday Workday videos this year. I know you enjoy watching this guy work. He's a great worker and a great friend. And we want to wish you a Happy New Year. So, Happy New Year. Happy New Year. For everybody. <laughs> for everybody. And thank don't forget to don't uh, forget. thumbs up, thumbs right? Up. Thank yeah, you yeah. very much. Yeah, thank you. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> If you enjoyed this video, please watch these. And don't forget to follow me on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter. And I'll see you in the next video.